Hi, Sue here, back with two more prompts for Junk Journal January. So here's my book. I've added a, um, a little uh, wrap, tie. First prompt is prompt number seven, positive vibes. So let's go in and take a look. I thought I'd do something a bit different today. Um, unfortunately, the video camera let me down and I've only managed to film half of it, so I've had to take photos of the second part. Sorry about that. But it saved you wading through me, dithering around with sticking bits of paper down. So I'm using an envelope. Um, this is uh, a junk envelope and I'm resizing it to fit my page, covering it with uh, scrap paper, book page, odds and ends, and then adding a, um, adding a card inside. And the card has my, um, my little positive vibe written on it. So I've opened out the envelope, and I'm going to glue down the flap so that um, when I flip the page over, I'm going to tip this into the journal. When I flip the page over, it's easy to put the card inside. You'll see as we go along. Thanks for calling past today. Um, I'm actually speaking after I've made this video, just trying to work out which is best for me, which is easiest for me, really. We'll see how we go. So here we go. I'm going to cover it with strips of book page. There's some brown wrapping paper. Also a page from a Chinese um, book, like a dictionary, language book. And some music, uh, music paper. And it's really old, this paper, so it's quite brittle. Basically what I'll do is cover the envelope and then trim it down to size, tidy up the edges. Just to break up these layers, I'm adding some labels um, in between. As you can see, I'm just using a glue stick to glue these, um, these different papers down.
This is a little bird that I've um, fussy cut from a book. And um, the heart shape has a small quote inside which reads, Start each day with a grateful heart. I'll try and remember that. When it's really warm and raining outside and just want to be cool. So now I'm just playing around with how I want this to sit once that last layer goes on. I knew I wanted to hide the bottom part of the tree stump, but it was just working out how I, I didn't want this wide strip of the white book page either. So playing around here. There we go, I've trimmed this down enough now. It just sits along there nicely. It's quite fine, that paper, quite thin. So that's the sides all trimmed up just about. Now to place the, um, the heart the sentiment. I did flap around a bit with this. Um, yeah, it's hard when you're filming. I need to get a bit better with editing, I think. Edit some of the, um, some of the long drawn out decisions. But in the end, I was reasonably happy with how that looked. Just trimming off the tail of the bird there, it just sat over the edge. So this little label reads thankful. And I've chosen a red label to pull out the red text in that last piece of um, book page. Yeah, just looking at this, but I think in the end I decided not to go with it. So that was the front pretty much finished. And as you can see there, now I'm going to start um, covering the back. And this is where the video stopped, so instead of having to wade through me sticking down bits of paper, I've just got some photos of um, the way it looked when it was finished. Sorry about that. As this was another sentiment from a book or a quote from a book. Encourage one another day after day. 
Actually, it's from Hebrews 3.13. So here you can see it finished and I have attached it into the page, into the journal using uh, washi tape. The card, I have added some paper to the back for journaling. I did add a couple of bits uh, just to finish it off. Uh, I think a stamp, a washi stamp was the main item. So for number eight, I'm going back to a tag. And here I'm using some pieces that were gifted me from Crafty Kylie R. Uh, Kylie and I have known each other online for um, quite a few years now. Uh, she's a fabulous crafter, very, very pretty work. Anyway, she gifted me a lot of these bits and bobs, so rather than hoard them, I thought I might use them. So basically that will be the layout for my tag. But first off, I want to decorate this page. So I'm thinking I have some, this is scrapbook paper, and I'm going to layer this up. Like so. And then this pretty, this is a bit of a um, serviette or napkin, and I thought I might just add that over that top piece there. I also have a little file folder that I thought would be perfect for some extra journaling. So my plan is to add this as a tuck spot here, so that my tag can tuck behind it. So we'll see how we go. You can hear a buzzing in the background. I've got a fan on. It's another, it's actually very windy outside, but um, it's still quite warm and humid. I'm going to use my multi-media mat to um, adhere the serviette. Just a um, just a thin coat to start with. Try and get that as far as I can at the top of the page. Yeah. and then carry on the glue a bit further down. Okay, and a thin layer over the top. Hopefully this will then just blend into the background. Okay, so that's adhered nicely and actually it's drying quite well. So we'll move on to the tag. 
Will I move on to the tag? Yes. I've pre-cut um, or torn these pieces to save flapping around. So this one, just to add a bit of blue, because the opposite page has blue. And some coffee dyed paper. Now before I put the image down, I th was thinking maybe a couple of little pieces here. Um, I need Sorry about that. quite ready today round <laughs> yep we go. That's the tag. Now, I have this little file folder and I want to attach that to the corner of the page. And I want it there so that this one slips inside like that. So I think to do that, I might sew this on the machine. So I'll go ahead and sew it and I will be back. Okay, so I've sewn this on and just trim that ledge. And I've also um, put a hole in the edge here. I'm going to add one of my little dangles, I think, <laughs> we'll see. Just set this up. Okay. Well, I am having fun. The video camera's gone off a couple of times. I've had to clear the memory, so hopefully now I've got it all set up. What you might have missed was that I have attached one of my little mini tags, and this is where I will journal. And my, my um, floral tag 
we'll just slot it in here. Okay, I've got some a ribbon for the top. Quite like to have some bits hanging out from the sides as well as the top. So um, hence the tag on the side or the folder that tags to the side. Oops. That's better. Might just trim that down. Okay, so that just slots in there. I might have to add, think about this. I might have to add a little clip on there, I'll see how I go. Basically, apart from the prompt, that is it. <laughs> Finally, after I don't know how many goes with the video camera. So now this will we put up here? Yeah, I think so. to get glue all over the front of that one. Okay. There we go. So that's it, number eight. Florals. Thanks very much for joining me today and um, I'll see you again soon. Thank you. Bye.